What's up guys? Today we're gonna do something real easy, cauliflower soup. I made this, uh, just came up with it a couple weeks ago and it turned out pretty good. So I'm gonna make it again, take you guys along with it, but it's pretty easy, simple ingredients as always. Everything will be in the description below that I use uh, in all the directions, recipe, and nutritional information. So let's go ahead and do it. So here's a quick look at some of the ingredients. Spinach, heavy whipping cream, chicken stock, a cauliflower, about a quarter of an onion, and about a pound and a half of Italian sausage. You can use any kind of sausage you want. Uh, I just thought Italian would be good with this. I'm also gonna use uh, white cheddar cheese and uh, some other stuff, but as always, everything will be in the description below. This is gonna be an easy one. I'm gonna start it and let, let it simmer while I'm working out, and then we'll come finish the rest of it. So let's get started. Start by taking half of like a medium-sized cauliflower and just take half of it and just break it up into smaller pieces. Just break the florets uh, into littler pieces, little chunks, so it'll add some like texture to the soup. And then we're gonna take the other half of it and rice it. Uh, so we'll have like a fine, really fine cauliflower and then we'll have like the little uh, florets. So it just adds some more texture so it's not just all like real soupy, but there'll be some chunks of stuff in there. In a soup pot, we'll go ahead and brown our sausage. While this is browning, guys, I'm gonna add a teaspoon of Italian seasoning and some cracked black pepper and some pink Himalayan salt. Add your rice cauliflower and mix it in. And then we'll add our diced onion and cauliflower chunks. After that, we'll add four cups chicken stock, or just one whole uh, box of it. One and a half cups water. All right guys, I'm gonna let that simmer for about an hour and a half, two hours while I go work out. You definitely can crank the heat up and let it go for you know a shorter period of time, like a half hour, 45 minutes till the cauliflower is tender. But I'm just gonna turn it low, let it simmer and uh, cook for about hour and a half, two hours while I go work out. We'll come back when I'm done, finish it up. It's gonna be great guys. See you in a minute. All right, our soup's been simmering for about two hours now. So we're gonna go ahead and finish it up guys. So let's do the final steps here. Now we're just gonna stir that into the soup. We're gonna add some Collier's white cheddar. Uh, this is really good. It's got a really strong taste, uh, powerful Wellish cheddar. I don't know if that's like a kind of a cheese, but it's got a really strong flavor, but when you mix it in with the soup, it tastes really good. So I'm gonna go ahead and shred up about a half to three fourths of a cup, and then we're gonna add that to the soup and melt it in. It's gonna add just a really awesome flavor to it. Go ahead and add that into your soup and stir that in until it's all incorporated and melted into the soup. This is also a really good time to taste it for salt and pepper. You can add uh, more salt, more pepper to your preferred taste. You can also add red pepper flakes for a little bit of spice or whatever else you think it needs. Last step, we're gonna add about two cups of fresh spinach right at the end. And then we're gonna stir that in and just let it go till it welts. Uh, and it starts to get a little bit uh, looser and welts up and then the soup is ready to eat guys at this point uh, doesn't take long for it to start to welt up so once that's ready we can go ahead and plate a bowl up all plated up i put some uh, finely shredded parm on there for a little extra cheese flavor on top but it's really good guys it's got a really rich flavor from the cheeses in there and the heavy cream and the sausage but it's just a really good creamy cauliflower spinach and sausage soup i hope you guys like it give it a shot let me know what you think in the comments below if you tried it if you added something different let me know and as always guys thank you hit that bell button to get notifications when new vids come out and i'll see you guys in the next one thanks for watching